I'm Mary Savoy. If you're French, you pronounce that Muddy Savoy, which is much prettier. I'll be 80 this year. When I was about 60, my doctor mentioned to me that cataracts, if you live long enough, become a problem. And I had lived long enough to have the beginnings of them. He didn't even talk, come back in a year. And finally, this past year, I complained bitterly that they may not be ready, but I want to see. And he sent me to Dr. Montague. A cataract is your natural lens, which has become cataractus, which kind of means turning yellow or hazy. And when it does that, it makes it so that you can't see through it anymore. And once it's visually significant, we fix it with surgery. My left eye was done about 12 days ahead of the right eye in a manner that is ordinary in this day and age. When I went back for the post-op visit with Dr. Montague, she broached the subject of this new technique. This femtosecond laser was developed here in Silicon Valley at a company with its roots at Stanford. It has the ability to create laser-guided incisions, which means the surgeon doesn't have to do it manually with the blade. And it does this based on a 3D scan it does of the individual's eye. It has the ability to break up. Very interesting. And she had told me that this is the first time that this was being done. And I said, does that mean I'm experienced with the first surgery? Hey, Mutt. Even now, I know I've had something done to my left eye. I can't even tell I've had anything done to my right eye. And yet the left eye was done 10 days, 12 days ahead of the right eye. The difference is phenomenal. The inflammation after the surgery is much less in the patients that receive the catalyst laser, which means faster recovery for the patient also. I think this is one of the most amazing things to come along in cataract surgery, and I think it has the potential to change cataract surgery tremendously.